the Torah is open to speak names for healing, and there's a blessing, and, and it, that came to my heart this morning, partially because Emily, who, who this Torah portion, she was born during this Torah portion, fell yesterday. She was going to be here today, but she fell down the stairs. She's okay, but she's she's in pain, so that's why it came to my heart. And it's so beautiful that what you just said, we didn't know. We don't know anything that's going to happen because it's the Lord that orchestrates all. And so this is all about healing. And when the Torah is open, that's you. You know, this is open right now, but the Torah is open because because when, when you are in a place, the Torah is open. And then the Lord heals because he sends his word and he heals. So Shout out a name of those that are healing for physical healing, spiritual, any healing, anything, Father. Anyway, right now, too, um, 
It says, and you shall not profane, which is kalah, which means to wound. So when you hear the name profane, when something, when the Lord says, don't profane my name, don't profane my sacred things, it's really about wounding. It's piercing. Mm. It's, it's boring through. Mm. Um, that I, and it says, Al Tav, my holy name, that I may be sanctified among the people of Israel. I am the Lord who sanctifies you. Al Tav is when Yeshua said, I am the Alpha and the Omega, the beginning and the end. And it's placed all over scripture. And it's not just happenstance, it's in strategic places. And some places don't really make complete sense, but you know what? The Lord's ways are so far harder than our ways. So if, if those letters don't always make sense, how much more? How much in our lives doesn't make sense to us because we Hello. can't think with this mind. Hello. We have to think with the mind of the Lord. So we think of the Father. In Isaiah 53, it says, He was wounded. Same word, He was wounded for our transgression. He was pierced. He was profaned, is really what it says. If we want to use the English word, He was profaned for us already. And any time we profane, we take our name, His name. Now, His name is upon us. The Ironic Benediction, it says, And this is how we shall place Aleph Tav, my name, upon the people. Upon the people, my name upon the people. That name is all over you, that name is all through you, that name is him, his character. He created you in his image. So when we profane us, when we say something against ourselves, we're profaning him, we're wounding him, we're wounding the spirit of within us. That's that's not it's not truth. We're speaking lies unto it. So he says, Do not profane my holy name. You are that name. You have that name within you. So when we speak against ourselves, when we speak against someone else, we're doing that very thing that he already did. He's already been wounded for us. He's already been wounded for us. Yeah. When you were playing the, the song, um, the Gallows of Sin, I had a vision when he was playing the trumpet. That's your point. Sorry. I had a vision of Moses raising out his staff by the Jordan River. That's it, of the Red Sea. And after the exile, and they were, they were trapped. The Jewish people were trapped. And the people were complaining to Moses, why you brought us over here to die? But the people began to feel desolate because now they're trapped and they think they're going to die. But they didn't trust in God that it's going to bring them through. The, the river, and God is saying, trust me. In the storm, trust me. In the open sea, trust me. And that's what I could see, you know, the people were, so but when they saw the waters being open, they were free after that. And God, God comes through every Hallelujah. single time. Hallelujah! What he's saying to us, I come through every single time. You could be right there in the middle of it, but he, he, he provided the pillar of fire to be protected by his people to call through. And it was like, you know, how it, and it's, it was enough time for them to cross the river. In our lives, you just when the things are very, very tight, God is right there, and it brings you through right at the last minute. Yep. That's right. Praise God. Yeah. That's right. Thank you, Father. No. All right. Baruch Atah. Amen. Eloheinu melech ha'olam. Asher atah mitorat zemet. Ve'yeh elam atah v'tukhinu. Baruch Atah atonai. No ten atorah. Thank you, Father. Mm -hmm. Zelika, you have something to share? 